right, we're in Olgi, and uh, we're going to have a quick lunch in this Kazakh yurt, and then we're going to head a few hours up the road and camp somewhere, uh, meet up our horsemen tomorrow. freezing cold. It's probably going to storm in a couple days. And tomorrow we have to ride for six hours on horseback on these little leather saddles. But I could not be happier in my life than I am right now. This is so bitchin'. Okay, so the cars are leaving. That's it. We're really on our own with horses and camels. And it is starting to snow. Um, a light snow, but if you look around... It's a light snow falling all over the place. So now the adventure begins. This is the idea. To put yourself out there, put yourself in the environment, be in it, and paint what it is to be in it. Yes, there will be pictures of things. There's going to be a picture. But really, it's about what it is to paint here, to be here in a storm, in the snow, in the cold, with the paint running down the canvas. That's what the painting's about. Got a camel. It's going to have a mountain. But it's about being in this space. So we found this Kazakh family that's going to let us use their yurt for a couple days. We need to get another camel. We're hunkering down here. I'm going to use this as my paint studio. It's a real yurt, not like a, I mean, they like live here, but they're all staying in the other yurt right now. So we're going to paint in here. We're cooking in here. This is our home for a couple days uh, in the Mongolian Altai. Uh, and it's much warmer here than it is outdoors. We got two paintings here, painted them yesterday in the yurt, but uh, the paint's a little thick um, and it isn't fully dry, which means we can't roll them up, which means we're going to have to drape them over the top of the camels for our journey today, which luckily is not very far, and then we hope uh, they're dry by tomorrow. Well, it's come to this. We have wet paint and loaded camels, so for the day we'll be packing the paintings along on the back of the camels, exposed to the sun and the wind. Hopefully by tomorrow they'll be dry. This is cool. We tracked a uh, snow leopard's tracks up into its lair in these rocky crags behind us. And then we're, we're just traveling through this great big snowy flatland until we get to Lake Hotan, which will be a nice valley with trees in it. Well, that was a trip, and, and now we're looking down at Lake Hotan, and a couple hours from now, we'll be in camp. All good. Lost the camels, so we're uh, sending out scouts and checking out the landscape to see if we can figure out where our camels went, because uh, there's just a whole lot of nothing around here, uh, and we need our camels. I would just like to say how much I really like camels. Yeah, 
Değil gari. camping at a place called the battlefield because we are surrounded as far as we can see by the tombs of ancient warriors all these little mounds rising about of the plains all around us a bit of a cold wind but god it is beautiful here Well, now we know we're in Snow Leopard Country because there's a sign. All right, this is one of the last paintings and we're set up here in front of this ancient female shaman tree. Um, you can see it's all draped with these scarves and stuff. It's a very sacred area. It's also an area where we know the Snow Leopard comes because we can find gnawed bones and things right, right here at this very spot. It's a really potent spot for one of the last paintings. Uh, there's feathers all over that I can use for painting with. Uh, so I'm ready to get to work and we'll see what we do. Okay. This is cool. We're following snow leopard tracks uh, across this mountaintop in Mongolia. Uh, in Jargalan Mountain way above our camp, which is miles, miles below us. Uh, anyway, it looks like we're moving on, so I got to go. I am in a snow leopard's cave, overlooking the steps down below. There's sleeping places back in here and above me and right where I'm sitting. Um, no snow leopard right now, but we hiked up and tucked ourselves in here. It is stone cool. Oh, bury me not.